Welcome to another Traveler Theophilus episode. In this one, I wanted to explain why Mind Test has its own advantages uh, separate from No Man's Sky. So, for example, the file for Mind Test is 148 megabytes. Whereas the No Man's Sky file is in gigabytes. So the basic file, the basic game, requires a lot less system resources and functions well on far weaker computer systems. Now, another thing that I noticed, and I actually learned this from my wife, is uh, you could play mind test and for example run videos okay you could put it on half a screen for example on windows on the other half of the screen because some of you wanted to know how I got the staff or, uh, and if you don't mind playing on a half screen, so I will. You um, could watch whatever movie you want. Probably video number six. And play it comes after while watching it. You do the which is a different. How do you say it's Artemis a different line, groove than No Man's after Sky? You go to a um, harmonic camp and I hit escape to get to here. It's a different groove than say No Man's Sky would have. But, uh, so, uh, you know, it's less resource intensive. Uh, you can play it on weaker systems. And when you play it, you could uh, kind of multitask a little bit. And that's all I wanted to show you this episode. Thank you for watching.